Called Paul Kuznikov is from the recruitment company AEP Baltic Link. Good morning to you, Paul. Good morning. Good morning. So, of course, you employ and help facilitate the employment of uh, people who legally are entitled to work here, certainly for the time being anyway. What do you think of, of Byron Berger for organising this so-called training session, but knowing that, really, it wasn't about training, it was about the Home Office catching illegal immigrants? Uh, well, what I would say, that every responsible employer must carry out all relevant uh, checks, for example, the right to, right to work. Unfortunately, at times, for employers, um, it could be impossible to spot fake documentation. Yeah, obviously, when the Home Office involved, the employers must cooperate fully. Otherwise, they, they could face severe penalties. So I would personally say that the Byron Berger uh, have done the right thing. And do you, do you think that from a, a, a reputational point of view, it will do them any harm? Uh, no, I don't think so, because they've been compliant, you know, they did the right thing. But on the, other th uh, on the other hand, I would say that it's a shame that people have to rely on um, fake documentation to gain work in this country. You know, this kind of thing surely carry a risk of them being caught and deported. If you were in a similar kind of position as an employer yourself, if you were given a tip-off from the Home Office that you may well be employing people illegally, would you set up a meeting so that they would all be in the same room? Would you be prepared to cooperate with the Home Office to that extent? Oh, 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 once again, I think when you've got so like Home Office involved or Inland Revenue and organisations like that, you have to cooperate fully, you know, otherwise you will face severe penalties. OK, thank you very much indeed.